Hi, I'm Louise Maris. I am a professor here in the Department of Communication Arts at UW-Madison and an affiliate at the Institute for Diversity Science. And I'm working on a research project with a partner, Anthony Chen, who is a postdoc at UC Irvine. And the central question of our research project has to do with the types of mass media storylines that can build parent support for their LGBTQ teens. So for parents, it's often something of a journey. They don't always start necessarily from a position of accepting and supporting and feeling comfortable with their teen's identity. And we're interested in two things. First, the types of storylines that they might be willing and comfortable to watch, given the different sort of places that they're at, uh, what will they seek out and what will they avoid? And then what are the effects of different storylines? Uh, so we know that there are some where parents model support and some where parents sort of show rejection. Um, and we're really curious whether um, those are more or less helpful for parents in different kind of emotional situations, both in terms of how much they ultimately support their child's identity and their interest in kind of collective action to support or oppose LGBTQ identity <clears throat> more broadly.